Back now on Today in AZ, Scottsdale's annual Dia de los Muertos celebration starts today. But like most other events this year, it does have strict COVID-19 precautions in place. Team 12's Jen Wall shows us how they're changing things up a little bit to keep family and cultural traditions alive. Yeah, normally the entire street behind me is blocked off for the Scottsdale Dia de los Muertos event, but because of COVID-19, it's going to look a lot different this year and with a socially distant feel. These are the stories, the experiences that happen and some will be comical, you know, and some will be somber. Father and son artist duo Such and Champ Styles. Family affair is what we're all about. Yeah, from one you generation know, to the one next. One generation to the next. You got my dad's. You got mine. Are showing multiple pieces at this year's Dia de los Muertos art installation at the old Adobe Mission. I grew up in the barrio, um, so there's little elements that I love putting. You know, you have like the telephone wire. Absorb what was around me with family and whatnot. And so this is the staple what we'd call like a cholo. Robert Ramirez is the founder of the event. He says while many celebrations are going virtual this year, he got special approval from the city of Scottsdale to open. In order to come here, you must obviously have a mask. We are going to have a queue in which we will be keeping track of who actually walks into the installation. So while the time spent remembering loved ones who've passed on will be scaled back, artists say handing down generations of family stories and memories. You know, I could only hope to be um, you know, what he is now, you know, I, I love make, my dad. Make me cry, you know, I love my family, <laughs> you know. Are at the heart of coming together. The event is free. It runs through Monday, 9 a.m. until 10 p.m. each day. For details, go to our website, 12news.com, and click on this story. For now, we're in Scottsdale, Jen Wall, 